Hello, and welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Hosted by me, Frederick. <laughs> what? That's enough of that. Here is Tyler the Cremator to play the Star Wars game. <laughs> Uh, yeah, here, here I am. Thanks. Thanks, Frederick. Let's, let's just, let's just, let's just play. Let's get going, BD1. Oh. Oh, why am I going this way? You passed the test. So you knew about BD1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Patoli weed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. That little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Yeah, I just have a holocron lying around. No big deal. Use the force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order. I didn't remember and defeat that. The Empire. Obi Wan made a little okay, appearance. No problem. Let's get it. I wonder if Except he's in the, the next game. Hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. Probably not. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right. Well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look. Before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? Yeah. I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. Yoda was rude to her once. Rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. True. Are you with us? We're in. Death mirrors Zepho. It's your choice. Such an interesting shape. For a creature. Let's go choose, shall we? So next, let's go to. Ah, uh, yes. Zepho. Hey, I want to go here. Let me go there. Travel here. Today, our great military is dedicated to enforcing the laws of the Empire, yielding to no one who seeks to destroy our galactic harmony. You hear that garbage? Turn it off. Turn it off. Do you think anyone buys this junk? Too many on the core worlds. 
Your daily lives haven't changed much since the Empire took over. Oh, come on. Some of them are even richer than before. Not like the expendable world. Not like Latero. And as long as the Emperor keeps the right people happy, it'll never stop. That's why we need the Jedi. Then we better get this hollow thing fast. Sit down, kid. It's time to land. Okay. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Bob's ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> landed. Greasy <laughs> money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Okay. Cal, over here. You did good work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. Yeah, I'm gonna Heard go. Of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. Hang on. All right, I'm just gonna go. Good work. Oh, we did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. Locked from the other side. You know how sick I am of hearing that? Very sick of it. God, what did I just finish saying? Um, I feel like this, I should like stop that, but at the same time, I. I think I'm Watch out, BD. Oh. You don't look friendly. You dodge me? I don't think so, little bud. You don't. Huh. Woo. Cal, can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zeppo. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been formed already. Did they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into there. Don't touch them. 
that's a protected rare species that I would definitely never hurt. Another one? Another one. Nice job. dismemberment so that's that's fun onward we go no you don't forced the villagers from their homes frightened refugees shipped off to work camps or worse supposed to do here oh maybe maybe go this way feels right no I'm not probably gonna learn like force pull or whatever while i'm in here because i don't know it yet ah uh, yes we got the skill points what will we buy with the skill points let's find out Unlocks a powerful strike that is deadly against weaker enemies. 
Cal's maximum force is increased. Cal's maximum life is increased. Holding slow allows Cal to slow his target for a longer duration. Cal dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over. Let's do that one. Yeah, buddy. What's next? Attack after a quick evade allows Cal to quickly perform a kick attack. What's this? Attacking out of a sprint allows Cal to perform a special lightsaber attack. That one sounds fun. All right, cool. Easy peasy. Can't see shit. premature on that God, what the hell are you problem. That was that was a little silly. Just say that. We, have, we just started fighting. Who's next? Not following? 
Ah. Hello. have whatever we need yet for this i can't push it not with that attitude this? you can't sorry about your scalping oh i have another skill thing getting them so fast We're gonna have to kill those stormtroopers again. There's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean... That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. Looks like I gotta come back. Bilger <laughs> was wounded, but he took out a trooper. on that. Royal Fluzz. I love Royal Fluzz. Just hanging. Monkey man. Yeah. Ah! Oh. Oh, we're fine. I think we got to go up there. No, I'm not. Oh man, that was crazy. Ah. 
Oh, you want some of this? I think he does. Woo, woo. This is where you going? Cool. Skill point. Can't stop, won't stop, you know. Why not? Of Cordova. I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage for now. track.
Can't get through. Not yet. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something pulling me there. Beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the force sharpen your instincts. All right. I'll do my best. Forced me. You forced me. Let's go, BD one. Huh. Another one of these. I wonder if they connect. I think I'm not fat. I wouldn't be able to fit through any of this. Never seen a storm do that before. That's pretty neat. Yeah, it's incredible. My friend, I believe this to be the earliest Cepho site we've uncovered yet. My reservations. I cannot chase the Bagano fault from my mind. Its vision shaped the direction of an entire culture. I must understand why. Tomb. And the Empire? There's no sign of them down here. What about Cordova? Still not sure what I'm supposed to find. He's a little... Eccentric? Tell me about it. But he wouldn't send us here for his amusement. Keep it on his mind. I guess this doesn't work like Zelda. Oh. I'll have to get like the pole or whatever. See that? What the hell is that? Ugh. I forgot how awesome this game was. Just like the vibe, the little music that just sounds like the old movie. It's just awesome. Game rules. Can't wait for the second one. All right. Note to self. Don't hit the skunguses. Oh, fuck. I just landed on one. What? Why, why did I jump? Back off, Skungus. I don't know why I don't want to Pretty hurt. There we go. Hello, Ratatouille. Hello, Ratatouille's brother. I thought I pressed it. Oh. Okay. Oh, ball.
the fuck? Mm. I pressed... Oh, maybe if I use the force to freeze it and then... It's stuck. This is awful. All right, what am I doing wrong here? Is that optional the whole time? I'm so sorry. There we go. I'm gonna say it. These ball puzzles suck.
I must uh, there's there mu there's no way I can turn that back on. Give me the force push pull already. Don't like that. Nope, that's ice. These things are so ugly. Ugh. Guess a lightsaber can't solve everything. <laughs> but they come back. Gotcha, Tomb Guardian. Out. Ah. 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 
guess. The Jedi do not seek aggression, but we stand against it. The Force is there to shield us. Okay. The obstacles in your path define the path. What stands in the way becomes the way. Now, try okay. again. <laughs> Push the ball before it reaches you. Good. Continue. Faster now. Complete the test. It stands in the way and becomes the way. We did it. We did it. We did it. Well, I think that that's a good place to stop this episode. Don't you? No? Oh well, I'm making that decision myself. <laughs> anyway, thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like and subscribe. It helps us out quite a bit here at the funeral home. Quite a bit. <laughs> anyway. Thanks for watching. Be sure to tune in to the next exciting episode of Jedi Fallen Order. <laughs> okay. That's enough. Until next time. Stay spooky. Ha ha ha.